fear a God, fearing Filipino, and you are not into something which is destructive to your fellow men, you have absolutely nothing. I will die for you. Uh, no, ma'am. I do not have plans of running a national post. Um, in the 2019 election, I, w I have plans of running in the first congressional district of Davao City. Excuse me. As Congress. So, hindi mo senador ba? Tsaka kung tatakbo man akong senador, hindi ako mag-a-announce ngayon. Masyadong maaga. Pero wala talaga. Not even a No, no, no. Um, in fact, we are asking them to join us. And this is a call for our country. Let us support the government. Some of them are working in the government. Let's, let us turn this country around and um, do everything uh, for the Philippines. Kasi napansin ko, sinabi ko kanina, parang ang nangyayari kasi, Pilipino sa Pilipino na ang nag-aaway. So dapat ang kalaban natin, yung mga kriminal, mga terorista, yung kahirapan, yun yung totoong kalaban natin as Pilipinos. Hindi yung kapwa natin na Pilipino. That's why um, I, I took this initiative to call for an alliance for individual groups um, to be a positive voice in their respective uh, communities. Kasi even sila doon sa communities nila, sina, sila na rin yung nag-aaway-aaway. So, sabi ko, um, they can be individually or collectively positive. Magkaaway man kayo, pero yung ginagawa mo, positive naman. Yung ginagawa ng kalaban mo, positive naman. So, it will be ano, good for the country. It will be good for the community. Sino ang meron ba nito, ma'am? Ang advice ba natin sa kanilang uh, wala na yung, wala nang taking ng pilawan sa mga social media spaces para maging conducive ng discussion? Um, yes. Uh, yes. But uh, we understand uh, human nature yun, merong pride, merong anger. Pero sinasabi ko lang, maging positive tayo. Direct it in a positive way. Parang kung ayaw mo naman makipag-aliansa, ayaw mo naman makipag-grupo, gumawa ka na lang ng something positive for your country. Not uh, do something against your fellow Filipino. Here it was raised in your kanina some of the attendees here like Mr. Uh, Uson, other bloggers, are they, they themselves are behind well, there's been an accusation and allegations that they're behind spreading fake news etc. that can be considered para kanina, uh, Yusek, Jimenezek can be considered destabilizing to you. So, kasama ko ba yun sa pakiusap din is na maghinay-hinay din uh, lahat yes ma'am what are we are trying to say is that we come together for our country not uh, not go against each other to the detriment of our country parang napansin ko kasi isang taon na tayo pa rin yung nag-aaway-aaway na dapat sana nagtutulungan tayo to turn around this country. And I started it with the groups who, were, who will listen to me. Sinabihan ko sila kanina, sabi ko, we only have five years to turn this country around and make it a globally competitive player in the ASEAN region, which is dapat, yun yung focus talaga natin. Hindi yung bring each other down, destroy each other. Hindi sana ganon. We can do that in the next election again. Not uh, right now. Kasi kailangan natin magtrabaho lahat para sa mga komunidad natin. Kailangan natin magtrabaho sa sariling LGUs namin, kami, and um, our national officials to work on our country, our government. Ang nanibalang may tanong ito sa inyo, Pero, nabang nyo ba ito kay Presidente? Ano yung sinabi? Wala. Wala. 
hindi ko nabanggit sa kanya na meron kaming ganito. But I'm sure siguro na-mention sa kanya because I saw speaker Abelia kanina uh, calling, answering the call of the alliance. So, nandun siya kanina. So, I guess uh, the president already knows about this. Hindi na kay, alam nyo, dapat kasi yung presidente nakatutok doon sa trabaho niya. Yung mga ganito, dapat sa atin na tumanggaling eh, sa tao na, sa private sector na on our uh, personal capacity to um, unite and work together for our communities and our country. Hindi ko naman kailangan yung mga tiga Luzon para sa kandidatura ko sa Davao eh. So, no. This is not elections 2019. Uh, no. Uh, because obvious naman na yung political alliance namin lahat. Napapanalo na nga namin yung president. Uh, may nilagay na kami na president dyan sa Malacanang. So, obvious na yung political alliance dyan. Um, ang sinasabi ko sa kanila kanina is uh, let us work together. And sinasabi ko din na uh, we are calling on others who want to work with us. If you do not want to work with us, just be positive. So that uh, meron siyang magandang effect sa community. Having being positive, on social media, that's where many people are talking about their idea. Na rude behavior of uh, some netizens. How would, ano yung appeal nyo doon sa, sa pro-administration uh, supporters online who also are accused of um, bullying others or engaging in unruly behavior and cursing at them. Alam nyo, ang totoong buhay kasi, wala sa social media. So if you cannot stand the heat in social media, lumabas kayo, i-log out ninyo, i-deactivate ninyo yung accounts ninyo, and then focus on your communities. Kasi ang totoong buhay talaga is yung nangyayari sa atin araw-araw sa loob ng bahay natin, paglabas natin ng bahay, yung traffic, yung yung problema natin sa, na walang trabaho, yung problema natin sa trabaho natin, yun yung um, totoong uh, buhay. So, if you cannot stand the heat in social media, you better get out of it. I'm just taking up your question. Yung, yung tamang asal ba? Yung tamang asal, would that also be promoted, I guess? Uh, yes, ma'am. Tamang asal in the, in, in the internet, in the social media. Of course, of course, yes. Oh, um, ganun na din yun. Uh, calling for uh, positivity in everything that you do. Um, and um, wag lang tayo uh, tumutok sa kung paano natin masira yung kalaban natin. But tumutok din tayo sa kung paano natin matulungan yung ating bansa. Ma'am, last week, si Senate President Pimentel nag-release na ng pangalan ng mga possible senatorial slate. Pwede kayang manggaling yung uh, uh, hindi mapupunan kasi parang sabi niya hindi niya kaya yung 12. Uh, pwede kayang manggaling dito sa alliance, yung bubuo doon sa Magic 12? Oh, hindi ko alam sa kanila. Sir. Or pwede kayang magbanta? Or may recommendation? Wala, wala akong... Wala ak Ang sa, ati, sa akin lang is I call on voters this early pumili kayo ng mga tao na alam yung magkatrabaho talaga. Ma'am, how will you be executing your plan? I mean, from today's launch. Paano ba to? Will you uh, have a series of Oo. Uh, uh, this is the, the launch. Uh, this is um, checking kung sino yung sasagot sa tawag namin na mag-alliance. And uh, napansin namin na marami-marami din sila na sumagot. And then we're trying to come up with a master list and then segregate them according to their community. And then, um, talk to them kung ano yung magawa nila para doon sa community nila, not um, together nationally. Kasi every community has a peculiar problem. So dapat, kung ako tiga tagig, tutulong ako sa tagig. Kung ako tiga kaluokan, tutulong ako sa kaluokan. Kung ako tiga Visayas, I'm sure madaming problema doon na pwedeng pagtulungan nila uh, bigyan ng solusyon. Can you give us lang ma'am a few kung ano-ano mga projects yung any vision yung nagagawin ng mga? Um, depende nga. As I said, sabi ko, every community has a peculiar uh, problem. Uh, 
As an example, sa Davao City, sa amin, ang, uh, ang very uh, makita mo na uh, parang nakatutok ngayon ng mga tao na problema, isang problema namin sa traffic. So what we're trying to do is um, support the modernization um, call of the national government and trying to come up with a high priority bus system and engaging engaging the the Bawenios to support the high priority bus system because we think that this will um, help uh, alleviate the traffic problem yung mga ganon so every community has a peculiar problem and i'm calling on everybody to use their group use their alliance in making a positive change in their communities hindi lang yung mga sumusuporta sa presidente okay last three questions guys um, it started with him. <laughs> so, so, so ano mo tawag sa convenor? Uh, kasi um, uh, it started with him. Sinukulit niya ako. Sabi niya, nakikipag-away na tayo lahat. And then, on, the, on one hand, nakikipag-away tayo. On the other hand, sinasabi natin, we want peace, we want peace. So, I took the initiative because I am not a member of any of the groups there. I'm a member of the Biyahing Do 30, which was only ako and mother ko, and yung family namin, and yung my high school classmates ko. Yun yung grupo na tumulong kay PRD. Hindi man ako member nilang lahat. So, I took the initiative na tum tawagin sila and uh, mga panya sa kanila na mag-aliansa at magkaisa and huwag kalimutan kung bakit sila nagkagrupo it was because they committed to be partners for change and see a change in our country. Nakakalimutan na kasi yun ng mga tao. Alright. Uh, delicious. <laughs>